僕は学園の防衛を指示されているどうやら俺って筋がいいらしくてこれからは俺も悪魔と戦えるぜこのままでは秩序を軽んじられると考えベテル全軍を持って攻勢をかけることになった。俺は強くなりたいんですあなたのようにほうほう彼の目標は崇高であるぞそのコリータが日本を呼び世の力を求めた人間よ内なる衝動に身を得られ大勢の生徒が連れて行かれたんだ愚かな神を信じながら禁断の身を望むとは一歩間違えば死ぬんだよな世界に不必要な存在なのだこの開口を喜ぶがよい楽にあの世へ行かせてやろうつまりこれは定められた運命であったとそういうわけか神の秩序は絶対であり大天使である私はそれを守らねばならない悪魔と戦えば多くの人間は死ぬこんな犠牲を生まないために悪魔召喚プログラムを手にしたはずが自分の弱さに呆れてしまうよ Of tribal harmony mean nothing when every day they cheat and abuse us. It tells of a world united as one tribe. If only our lives were anything like the world in the novel. Our lives are decided at birth by tribal purity, or by the differences that make us who we are. There was a plot in his life. One I wish I'd written out sooner. You're no ray of hope. You gave up on your hopes. But I will not. Now let's see what manner of story you'll weave. Let's do it. You'll be a hero. Trust me. Don't you worry, Hina. Any monsters we meet along our journey to the mana tree won't lay a finger on you. What is it? Are you selling something? You folks in the habit of staring at strangers?
俺は14の冬に生死の境をさまよいそして魔法を手に入れた魔法使いも出るくんや魔法使いの生きづらさは同じだから私たちは魔法機動隊に所属するいわば政府公認の魔法使いルブルム中毒者が違法魔法行為逮捕危険魔法使いは成敗してくれるわ夜の渋谷のカオスそれが人を引きつけてやまない漂う魔法物質ドミヌスの森Supreme Commander Zeyu is coming. The end is only the beginning. Beyond Sandland lies a greenish world, populated by even more unique and dangerous enemies. Be ready to advance in this adventure. Careful, your first fight is coming. Fists up. In combat, Beelzebub is a ferocious fighter that has access to light and heavy attacks, which can be chained both on the ground as well as in the air. Don't forget to dodge in midair and sideways. Sometimes, get closer to the enemy silently and... As you progress in your journey, you will gain points that can be spent to unlock Beelzebub's skills. You will be able to power up special skills, such as the ability to turn your body to metal, or even dark release. That hurt, you stupid jerk. Don't forget that even the strongest fiend needs a power up, so manage your supplies. Consumable items can increase your attacks, defense, and help you recover power of darkness, so make sure to stock up. Also, water is an important resource that you can restock in water supply points and will be consumed to heal your health in case you are about to be defeated. All vehicles in Sandland have unique features. The jump bot will bounce over high cliffs. The hover car can float over water to cross dangerous rivers. And the battle armor can move heavy obstacles to open blocked paths. Remember, you can carry up to five capsules, each containing a vehicle at any given time. So plan ahead according to the situation and play style. We'll probably find traveling merchants on the main road. Vehicles will not only increase the agility while exploring, but will also prove to be very useful in battles. With higher firepower, mobility, and resistance, vehicles can stand up against huge enemies and tank groups that Beelzebub alone struggles to defeat. But be careful. <laughs> Of course we know that Final Fantasy 7 Part 3 is gonna come out, but the gameplay shown right now is Final Fantasy Rebirth. Um, it is set to be announced, so I don't know for sure, but yeah, Final Fantasy Trilogy is gonna be the most anticipated JRPG of all time. 
That's why I put this in the list. You know, I thought I mentioned Runa because this is an indie title and it does have some interesting set pieces to the game like uh, puzzle solving and the uh, inspiring turn-based JRPG. I don't know for sure if the gameplay is gonna be like Persona but it does look like Persona 5 and it is made in Unreal Engine 5 so it does look pretty interesting. From the trailer, I can see that it is... The gameplay is a bit clunky and I hope they are gonna polish it out later on when the game is set to be released. Well, the last but not the least is Kingdom Hearts 4. Two years ago, we got this trailer and we don't have any more updates to the game. And man, I am super excited about Kingdom Hearts 4 because it is, of course, the next chapter of Kingdom Hearts. The Lost Master Arc, man, cannot wait, cannot fucking wait. And I think in this game, they're gonna push the Final Fantasy-esque art style to the game, even though it doesn't have that Kingdom Hearts charm anymore, it only has that Final Fantasy charm again, but I, I, you know, I'm not complaining, because as you can see, Final Fantasy VII looks fucking beautiful. And if this game is as beautiful as Final Fantasy VII, or even better, I'm just, I'm not complaining, man. I'm not complaining at all. So I guess that's pretty much it about the list. Sorry if I do uh, sound a bit off because I am quite sick at the moment. That's why I'm not posting anything. This is my first post in like five days. Hope you guys enjoyed it and thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'll see you guys again in the next one. <laughs>一度退場すれば元の世界に戻れると思うな。手がかりに見つかるといいね。はい。どこへ行くんだ。<音声><音声><音声>